holiday wreath. I don't like to buy them. You don't need to buy them because they're so easy to make. So we're doing this one with everything from the Dollar Tree. I have these little wire rings that I got. We're gonna use these, but if you can't find them, they also have this one, which I've done before and it's really cute too. You can just wrap it with some ribbon or burlap or something like that. So there's so many things you can do and it's really fun making your own wreath. So, we are also going to use three owl ornaments. I have these two and this little guy. And then we're also gonna use four Christmas picks. I just got all of these from Dollar Tree. You're also going to need some of these pipe cleaners. I also got these from the Dollar Tree. All right, and then I also have my glue gun. And then I have a ton of ribbon. I don't know yet which one I wanna to use to make the bow. But these are all just $1 ribbons. So yeah, we are gonna make a Dollar Tree wreath. Let's get started. All right, so you are going to take your first pick and then just kind of bend it so it's more like an arch. And just put some hot glue on it. And then put your little guy here. And then to double hold it, I am going to wrap one of my pipe cleaners around it, just so it stays really well. There it is. And I'm gonna go all the way up to this part. Wrap it all the way around like that. There, and that's nice and secure. So then for the second one, I'm gonna get my hot glue gun and just put it right over the top of this first one. Let's do a generous amount like that. And then I'm gonna take my second one and then just kind of arch it in like this again. And it's just gonna go like, I'm gonna kind of situate my leaves. But it's just gonna go like this right on top. another pipe cleaner and just wrap it around the base of these two. Just kind of connect them and connect them to the wire. There it is. There we go. So there's our first two look like this. Very cute. All right. And then I don't need your help, mister. We are going to come over on this side and we're gonna do the pick going the other direction. Put it up like that. And then you can add some more glue. Right there. Okay, set this one on top of that one like this. Okay, move it up farther. There we go. And then take another pipe cleaner and then you're just gonna wrap this one around. Hey, handsome. Hi, handsome boy. Okay. Keep wrapping like this. And then there we go, like that. Now you're gonna get your last pick and it's gonna go just right in here, kind of arch it again like we did the other ones. And I'm gonna move it around behind this one. So it looks like this along the back. And then just add some glue, like this. Okay, second pick goes like this right on top. And then you're gonna take another pipe cleaner and just twist this on in place. Like that. Do it pretty tight, that way it's secure. And there are our cute picks. That looks so pretty. So there's your base of your wreath. Just like that. Okay, okay. So now you have this kind of gap right here and that is where you can attach your owls. So I'm gonna start with this little chubby guy right here. He's so cute. He's gonna go on first right in the middle. So I'm gonna put a bunch of glue, kind of a lot right here. 
because this is where our chubby little guy is gonna sit. So now I'm just gonna take him and he's gonna sit right there on top of it. And then just kind of hold it so it stays and it's not gonna move. There he is, he looks so cute. But that's what I have so far. Stop. Now I'm gonna add in my other little guys. I think I'm gonna put the glue right on the owl for this one. And I'm just gonna do a ton of glue on it like this. There we go. And this one is gonna go right here next to him. Oh yeah, that's really cute. So this is what you have so far. Kind of let this guy dry before you flip him over though. Make sure he's in there really good. And he's gonna go on this side, I think. So then we're gonna add glue onto the front of this guy. Kind of a lot. And looks like that. And then we're gonna push this guy in right here next to his friends. There you go. And I'm just gonna hold them in place. That's really cute. Which ribbon should I use? Mom? So I have this guy. I'm gonna use this as the embellishment. And I'm actually gonna, actually I should've cut this. So I'm gonna cut them off these guys too. So I'm just gonna cut their little loops off. This guy. Kinda cute, right? Okay. Yeah, so maybe this ribbon. And the white. There's so many cute ones. There really are. This one was a dollar, but I got this one from Family, family Dollar. So, but it was just one dollar. This one was, if you want this print. I find the Dollar Tree ones have this, have been having the same ones every year and I'm just ready for some new designs. <laughs> so I did get, um, this one's from the Dollar Tree. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I have four pieces of this one. I cut them into 12 inch strips and then I have four pieces of this ribbon that I cut into four inch strips. So now for your octopus bow, you're just going to make a loop like this. Okay, like about that. And then you're gonna add your other one in. Just do another loop like that and just keep it here with your hand. And then you're gonna do another one. Just keep going till you've used all of your ribbon. Like that. So cute, look at this combination. Looks adorable. Okay, last one, like this. So I just have four, like that. And then you can kind of move them around how you like them. But I really like these bows. So you can bring them forward and back, like that. And then if you leave these long enough, then you can use these to attach it to your wreath. Just kind of fluff it up like this. And that's your cute octopus bow. I'm also gonna dovetail my ends. Do that to all of them. Oh, you didn't do it too. There is our cute bow. And then I'm just gonna move the little legs out like this. Just kind of give them some life. Kind of like make them wavy like that. Looks so cute. And you can twist these around too, however you like. I usually twist them out all around because I like putting these on lanterns. But for this one, I'm gonna bring all the tails forward and tie it on to our leaf. And I think I'm just gonna put it right up here in this corner. That looks like a really cute. And I'm just using my little twist ties I have left. A nice little trick to attach it to my reform and then also I think I'm gonna add a little bit of hot glue because I do not want it going anywhere to 
takes a village, doesn't it, Amanda? Mm-hmm. Village. It's really cute. I love it. Do you love the, the ribbon? It's I just really love beautiful. the ribbon. It's amazing. There we go. Oh, well, that's are. super cute. Okay. And then where should we put the ornament? Okay, so the ornament. Let's see. Can they see though? I, I don't know yet. I'm going to see if I want to do that. Up there? I think right there. Look. So, guys, here's our cute little wreath we made. This is from Dollar Tree Items. It was only $11. So make your own wreath, y'all. It's so much fun. It's really neat. And you just feel so proud and accomplished. <laughs> so, and it was easy. All I did was hot glue it and use those little twist ties. And then we made a little bow. And these are just Dollar Tree ornaments and Dollar Tree picks. And I love it. And the, I know the little girls are going to love it. And it just looks so cute with our Christmas decor. And yeah, I hope you guys make one. You want me to tell you? Yeah. Okay. So cute. If you guys are looking for a really, really cute Santa Claus, we went to Walmart and we found this little guy. He's um, big. He's tall, yeah. I think we bought him for how much, Amanda, was he? $24.99. So $25. There was him and then there was like an old... Old Santa, what do you call old world Santa? Yeah, and where he had, he was more of a maroon, and then it mm -hmm. had like the suit was a little bit long, and then it had a little gold. And it was brown fur. Yeah, with the brown fur. Yeah, and Super he was cute, cute too. too. Mm -hmm. But I kind of wanted this one. The it, red, it's yeah, like bright red, more traditional. I hate, to, I feel bad, Amanda liked the other one. <laughs> But as mom, that's okay. I got my way this time. Yes. Sometimes she gets her way, but this time I got mine. Yeah. But we love him so much. And For so twenty-five dollars. We could not. I thought it I would be fifty. We love him with our little stuff. His little Santa chair. We yeah. are in love with it. And Amanda's cute wreath turned out so cute. Oh, I feel like Amanda. Look how fast she put that beautiful wreath together. Oh, it took just like you know, mm -hmm. fifteen minutes. And yeah. It was Eleven dollars. Yep. Dollar Tree items. Mm -hmm. Anyone can do it. Yep. And the best part about that, no one else is gonna have that. No. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So, and you know what's really nice about those wreaths? It's so nice to make one to let for your special friend or your mom. Yeah. My mom has always loved a wreath, hasn't she? She does, yeah. Always. Yeah. So, if you don't know what to get your mom this year, make her a wreath. I promise yeah. she'll love it. Anyway, y'all have a wonderful night. Thanks to you guys for coming with us and following us. Please subscribe to our channel. Yep. We and want to like, share. Yep, and ring like that it. bell. Yep. <laughs> we want you to come along with us. Yeah. So, yep. anyway, have a wonderful night. Yep. Bye. Bye.